I spend my days telling people to create effective messaging. But what is an effective message? It's one of those elusive terms no one ever defines. Today, I'm going to share with you what I consider to be the two main ingredients for creating effective messaging, whether that's an infographic, a presentation, uh, a memo even. I'm going to help you out. I'm Elissa, technical communicator and owner of Doodle Communications. An effective message is one your audience is going to walk away remembering and acting on. So to put it bluntly, no one creates a presentation or an infographic or a memo or an email or a social media post hoping that everyone will walk away forgetting that it ever happened. No one does that. We don't put our time and energy into such communication pieces to be forgotten. We had a purpose. What is your purpose? Why do you need to share your message? What is it you want audiences to do because of your message? Now, for example, maybe there's a process change at work and you create a presentation to share this new process change. You want people to remember the process change because they've got to start doing it and you're hoping they'll actually act on the new changes and start doing them. Or maybe you've got a new product and this product is way better than everyone else's in the, comp in the competing field. So you create an infographic that shows the specs and all the cool things your product does that no one else's does. You have a purpose. You're hoping your audience will remember your product first and then buy your product when they're looking for one. These are effective messages. You want them to be remembered. You want them to be acted on. To create memory in a message, your message must be visual. Humans remember visual information. They don't necessarily remember text on a page. They don't necessarily remember even auditory information so much as they remember visual information. So put compelling graphics with your information in some way that the human is able to remember that graphic and thereby the information that came with it. This is why effective infographics work so well. To help your audience act on your information, you then need to create a story to go with it. Why must they act? Why do they want your product over the next person's product? Why do we need to do the new process? Give a scenario. Create an environment that the person can put themselves in when they're in need of your new product, your process, whatever it is you need them to act on, paint the picture for them. What is life like without it? What's the future like without it? How does it affect them? So those are my two ingredients, visual storytelling. And those are really the bread and butter of my entire career and what I do. Your message is effective if it is a visual story and thereby it's memorable and it can be acted on. So stay tuned for more if you'd like help making more effective messaging yourself, visual communication pieces, please reach out elissa at doodlecoms.com. Until later!